for the Cockatrice Weekly. I'm playing Just Our Wildfires again. I played this yesterday and had a pretty good time with it, so figured I'd run it back. For those who didn't get to see yesterday, the basic premise of this deck is ramp out with a ton of mana rocks and then blow up all the lands with things like Wildfire, Armageddon, Ravages of War, Burning of Zinye, uh, that sort of thing. Uh, I'm even using a bunch of lands that have more than one mana, so things like the Depletion lands or the Fallen Empire Sacrifice lands. Um, because I don't really care if I lose my lands because I'm going to Armageddon, Armageddon them all away anyway. Um, so this is basically just a huge hyper mana deck. Um, I'm playing no spot removal because spot removal is efficient mana wise, but mana is not the bottleneck here. Uh, cards is, so I want my cards to be you know trading two, three, four for one if possible. So I've got a bunch of Wraths and stuff which you don't normally see, but it's pretty easy to subsidize them. Um, yeah, it's all held together with Tinker. Um, you know, basically the win condition is make a bunch of mana and do something big with it. Either, you know, put down a Portal to Phyrexia or a Sundering Titan or an Ugin or make a giant fourth Erlingus. Um, there's some Turbo Ring tech with the One Ring and Paradox Engine to just basically draw your deck and make enough mana to go infinite. Um, White Sun's Twilight is kind of interesting because it's both a Wrath and a win condition. Um, some cool things that I'm running are things like Bone with the Machine and Rush of Knowledge and Traverse Eternity, which draw cards equal to the highest CMC among uh, historic or permanents you control, which, um, considering I'm playing giant, you know, 8-drop artifacts and 7-drop artifacts, it's pretty interesting to be able to tinker into Chromatic Warrior and then immediately draw 7. Um, changes I've made since yesterday, uh, I had taken out all Graveyard Heat from the deck originally, and that came back to bite me when I faced a Breach deck, so I've added in Rest in Peace and uh, Soul Guide Lantern, just so that I have that avenue covered. Um, Rest in Peace is obviously way better, but it's a lot harder to find because I have a lot more artifact tutors than enchantment tutors. And I also added in a Banefire. Um, I don't really know if this is necessary, but it is a way to make an uncountable uh, method of killing someone, and it also works through Humility, which I'm playing, because Humility is such a beating against creature decks, which, you know, I don't have that many creatures, so I don't usually care about it. But it's difficult to win on the spot with like fourth Erlingus for X equals a million or White Sun's Twilight for X equals a million when you've got a humility in play. And main fire gets around that, plus it gets around counter spells. I don't really know if this is necessary, but I wanted to try it. So the things I took out, I took out a copy artifact, which is useful but not not super necessary. A sonic screwdriver, which was kind of awkward as a three mana rock, and then what else did I take out? Oh yeah, I took out the Gerard's Hourglass Pendant, because Gerard's Hourglass Pendant is really only good against uh, Time Vault or maybe like Seeker Walk or something. But for Time Vault, I've got Pivoting Needle and Sorceress Spyglass and By Force, so I think I'm okay in that matchup. And uh, I just needed some slots. So, yeah, this is Jeskai Wildfires. Uh, again, just playing this deck for fun. Uh, I'm, I don't expect this to be like the most competitive deck ever, but uh, it was pretty fun yesterday, so I wanted to run it back. Let's see how it does. Joe King Canadian Highlander Open is a competitive Canlander event happening on Saturday, June 8th at 9 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time. The event is designed with a low barrier to entry to encourage everyone to dip their toes into competitive Highlander. It only costs 10 US dollars to register, and the event allows 100% proxy decks. You don't need to own any cards, you just need paper proxies with official MTG art, a Discord account for rules and announcements, and a webcam and microphone for gameplay. First place gets a revised plateau with additional prize support determined by entry fees. And all information about the event, including proxy art policies, webcam-specific rules, and more are available through the Discord server using the QR code in the bottom right corner. Sign up today using the Melee.gg link on screen. These links will also be available in the video description below. This is an exciting new step for the world of Canlander tournaments, and I will definitely see you there. Oh, okay. <laughs> Guess I'll take the, uh, take the draw. Good luck to you too, and I'll keep. Um. Guess I will try the hands. All right, start us off. Okay, I'll probe you. Okay. Okay. Mm, I'll play Tropical Island and pass. Uh, I'll play this. 
Sacred Foundry tapped in Sago. Pose a saga and goes to one and can then pass. Let's do this inventor's fair and this fire diamond. Mm -hmm. Let's take out. Saga goes to two. Mm, yep. I play a windslip heath and pass. Um. Go oh, plateau. Oro signet. Mm It's signet. Hmm. Fear resistance. Mm, I'll cast in a face faction. Sure. I'll pass. <laughs> Mm, I'll fetch. Yep. It's a meticulous archive. Let's go on. I'll throw the mana from Saga. Sure. And switch. Mm-hmm. Mm, I'll get a mox diamond. Mm, oh, okay. As tenters, I'll discard the planes. Sure. Mm, I'll play tiger. Mm, and cast helmet. Okay. Mm, activate. Yep. Okay, mm. nice. Mm, okay, uh, so you take six. Then I'll dig squirrels. Mm -hmm. Go to combat, attack you for two. Yep. And pass. One tap, upkeep, gain one from Inventor's Fair. Draw. Play the soul ring. Mm -hmm. Let's go three mana. Or a basalt monolith, mm -hmm. and then shock in the steam vents and say go. Mm, I'll start by activating Kermit. Sure. Mm. Okay. Yep.
Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Three Caracas mm-hmm. and attack for six. Sure, I'll go to five. Mm-hmm. All right, end step, I'm going to sack this in Bender's favor. Mm-hmm. I'll go get the one ring. Mm-hmm. And untap, keep draw. Two, three, four. Or the one ring. Mm-hmm. Okay, I get protection from everything. Tap to draw a card. Uh, yeah, I guess I'm passing. Mm, okay. Can I turn out that gifts I'm given? Sure. Oh, I can't because it's target opponent. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Forgot about that. Okay, I'll activate comment. Sure. More squares. Yeah. Mm. We play Jace the Mind Sculptor. Sure. Mm. Brainstorm. Yep. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, untap, upkeep, lose one, draw for turn. Uh, tap the ring to draw two. And two. Three mana for a Trinisphere. Oh, that was mm, a odd sequence. Of yeah. It's okay. Two, three for this manifold key. Mm-hmm. I will untap my one ring. Draw three. One, two, three. Yes, that works. Okay, we'll go one, two, three for a balance. Mm-hmm. Okay. We'll discard this purple refraxia. I'll play this sandstone needle. Yeah. Oh, hope that comment doesn't kill me. Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, activate comment. Okay. Answer oh, for. 
<laughs> so, all right, I'll take the play this time. I'm going to walk in. I'm going to move again too. And I'll I'll and I'll time. keep this. On the bottom. It's gone. We're gonna shock in the steam vents, cast a Voltaic key. Okay, mm -hmm. in Arid Mesa, Mox Diamond, and sure. he's got a Tiger. Yep. Mm -hmm. I play a Retrofit of Foundry uh, and a Pass. Uh, pass. Okay, uh, I'll fetch. Mm, get the meticulous archive. Mm, survey to the graveyard. Mm, play Volk and uh, pass. <laughs> pass. Okay, mm, I'll make a server. The Caracas, mm -hmm. attack if one. Yep. Mm -hmm. And pass. See the sign on. Talisman of Creativity. Mm hmm. Sky Diamond. Mm hmm. Pass. Mm -hmm. And step, I'll make a construct. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, mm, attack for flow. Mm, yep. And pass. I suspect this is getting countered, but short guy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure, reserves. Okay, activate short guy. Hard. Go again, I guess. I'll play this in Venner's Fair and say go. I'll make a server. Sure. Mm -hmm. Go to combat. Okay. Uh, I'll jump block the 4 4. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That pass. Okay, I'm tap. I'll keep keen one from Venner's Fair. Let's activate Chorkai. Discard mm Hmm. 
one, two, three, four. Attempt to cast Armageddon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in response, I'll make a construct. Sure. Then it reserves. Okay. I'll play this plateau as my land for turn. Untap for a guy. I'll draw. We'll discard this mistress workshop. Go ahead. Mm, okay. Mm, I'll cast a source plosures on one of the pilot tokens. Sure. Game one. Then attack with both constructs. I'll block. I'll block one of them. Mm -hmm. In pass. Well. Let's go thought cast for one. Mm-hmm. Draw. Draw. Shorkai. Draw, draw. Um, right, this Spilonite Temple. Play this Ancient Tomb, take two, cast this Mind Stone, cast this Prismatic Lens, and pass. Okay, mm. I'll unholy hit the pilot token, then sure. go to combat. Yep. Four damage, I'm gonna untap and activate Shorkai. Mm hmm. Uh, I will discard this Chromox and I will jump block. So take four. Thank you. Uh, Let's go. Fire of Industry, three mana, or a Trinosphere. Mm -hmm. um, red, red, one, two, three, four, or a Burning Insignia. Okay, uh, yeah, I'll concede. Okay. Uh, I'll keep six. Yeah, I'm going to keep six too. I'm just thinking what I want to put back. Okay, start us off. Put mm, a delta and in pass. Practice and pass. Mm, I'll fetch. Yep. Oh. Oh, thundering falls. Sure. That's preordained. 
Mm, okay, uh, then I'll play Lotus Battle and I'll pass. Okay. Banner's Fair, Fire Diamond. Nice. And step I'll crack my Lotus Battle, please. Sure. Mm -hmm. I'll get the savannah and the medical circle. Sure. Oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Play the medical circle. Yep. Mm -hmm. Keep that on top and pass. Let's go. Talisman of Conviction. Mm -hmm. Talisman of Creativity. Mm -hmm. oh, it's not tapping. There we go. Razor Tide Bridge. Go. Mm -hmm. Savannah and play with Dark Faden. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I'll be in control of the Tasman of Creativity. Yeah. I guess I'll have it. It's another path. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Tap of keep a gain one from Inventor's Fair. Draw. Let's go. Full ring. Mm -hmm. Or spy glass. Mm -hmm. okay, so I get to see your hand. I will name that Mm-hmm. Two, three, four. Average four. Eight. Uh, oh, I'll play this line. Yes. Mm, okay. Um, I'll pass. Draw. I'm draw pass. 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 Mm. Mm, I got this card, this card, Angel of Indemnity. Okay. Uh, uh, pass. Okay. Uh, flood strength. Uh, I'll say go. Mm, okay, I'll fetch. Yep. Mm, because it's town trap. Yep. Mm, I'll cast a, a nice. Mm, tap whatever. I, I guess I'll tap this Fell Knight Temple. Sure. Mm, sure God. Yep. Okay. Mm. Play Mithras Bubble. Yep. Mm. Activate it. Uh, on me. You can't use it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm. Pass. Okay. Tap a keep. Draw.
this crystal vein. Sack for blue blue, sack for colorless colorless. Pain for red. red. White. White. Cast a wildfire. Mm -hmm. I cast a force of an exile. Okay. okay. This floating way to cast an enlightened tutor. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go get a up oh, this Rustville Bridge and Sego. Mm, okay, mm, I'll cast a mystical tutor. I'll get mm, a mana drain. Okay. Mm, no cats. Okay. A mountain. Yep. And Outcast, brother who sent being one life for the thousand. Yeah. And at least to go stay. And then finally, plus Dark Faden. Yep. Okay, and uh, discard Terminus and. Um, Terminus and. Jason Mind Sculptor. And Probu. To your ring. Yeah, it's in there. Mm, in pass. Uh, is it signet? Pass. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm, loot with that. Yep. Mm, discard phase of action and intuition. Oh no, I'd rather uh, discard the gifts and give them as a second card. Mm -hmm. Play Caracas and, and pass. This remote farm, sick up. Mm -hmm. And step cast the intuition. Yep. Okay. And then I'll just reveal Breach, Lady, and Sebrek. Yeah, that should still, that should be game. I'll give you the Lion's Eye Diamond. Activate Duck. Saga. Sure. Mm, cast the LED. Yep. Mm. Two, three. Um, okay. Uh, I'll crack the LED. This got my hand. Sure. Make three blue mana. Okay. Mm. Yeah, then I'll slash back several. Yeah. Okay. Reach. Yep. Reach. Then you get something mm, else. Reach then LED and LED. intuition for brain freeze. Yep, yep, you got it. Good games. Mm, GG. GG's. I'll pick the play. Good luck. Thank you. I'll, I'll keep this. I'm, I'm going to keep this. I don't know. Oh boy. I'll go Razor Fight.
Razor, razor Verge Thickets. Uh, wild Growth. Sure. Say go. Uh, let's go see to the sign on. Fire Yep. I'm gonna go Scrubland. Step three, cast a Gilwang. Sure. Um, just thinking here. Okay, this is gonna be Royal. Okay. So he's a three four with Ward One. Sure. I'm gonna write. Uh, I'll pass her, and I'll just keep. I'll just write the word one here, so, while I, we wait. Uh, where is it? Annotation. I'm going to solve the equation. Yep. I'll go get Tinker. Uh oh. Uh, and then I will pass. <laughs> Draw here. Okay. I'm going to play a Verdant Catacombs. Sure. I'll tap you right now. I'll flat. I'll play a Qatar Commando. Okay. A uh, Tinker is part of the cost, right? Yes. Yeah. Sacrificing it. So, so, oh, you can also stack your seat of the Synod, so, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, like, I guess I, I, I'll just try and destroy whatever you get. Uh, this, I'm going to also get a royal token, just in case you have anything weird. Okay. So I'm just gonna... Clone. Thatch. 4-2. With ward 1. And I'll attack you for 3 with Gilwain. Sure. Down to 17. Yep. And say go here. A set annotation. Our commando, my lovely. Please, surely this is gonna be enough. Surely. Have you considered just passing the turn to me? That would be I'm very. That'd be very kind of you if you just pass turn to me. I'm going to leave this is it signet? Yep. And this sky diamond. And then I'll pass. I'm going to crack this Verdant Catacombs for a lush particle. Sure. Tap. Survey mm -hmm. one. Yep. Mm. I'll move that to the graveyard. Okay. Right, untap a keep draw here. Oof, okay. I'm going to play a horizon canopy. Okay. I'll tap two, three, four. Yep. Lose a life. I'll cast a questing beast. Okay. Um powers to our last dupe. I'm going to go get a sorcerer here. Sure. Five five. 
Yep. And all right. Um, move to combat. Yep. I'll attack you with everything. Sure. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and then I'm going to scry one. Yep. I'll I'll keep that on top. Okay. Right. Say go. Let's go. Let's workshop. Yep. Or for a friend dynamo. Yep. One, two, three. Or a tinker sacking the seat of the Cylon. Yep, I have no response to that. Get a chromatic orrery. For five, for three. Yep. I wonder if I should have responded somewhere there, but well, I don't know. I... Well, these two are mana abilities, so you don't have priority. Yeah. Yet. Oh yeah, that's right. So, Bullet Citadel, One Ring doesn't save you. Just thinking here, how do I lose? I'm tired of losing to artifact decks. Nine. Please have mercy. Cast this White Sun's Twilight for X equals 7. Um, yeah, uh, do you make the might tokens as well? Yes, yeah, so I gain 7 okay. life, make 7 mites, and then destroy all of the creatures. Okay, yeah, uh, let me just check something on my deck really quickly, if you don't mind. Okay. Uh, this that's you should not be in your library in game. <laughs> huh? I oh, if, mean, if you I just mean oh, like, then you'll know the order of your library. <laughs> oh, that's fair. I mean, I could just know my deck list, but yeah, that's fair. I apologize. Yeah, I mean, I don't mind you bringing it up on like a uh, box field or something. That's fine. Yeah, I'm just thinking here. Do I... Can I win from here? Uh, the mites cannot block, correct? Just making sure. Correct. They just are 1-1s one with Toxic 1 and can't block. Okay, yeah. Um, well, I'm just gonna sack this Qatar Commando to destroy the Orrery. Yep, makes sense. And, and yeah, that resolves. Seven of these again, seven life. Yep. Uh, and then I will pass. Oh, you gain seven life. Oh, Jesus. Okay. I was doing all that math for nothing. <laughs> all right. Untap, upkeep, draw here. Wait. Oh, I shuffled my library because it was uh, when I was looking at it. Yeah. Hit. Uh, I can tell what I had on top. Oh, if right, you don't you, scri you scribe. Uh... Yeah, I can reveal to you so that at least. Uh, let me. Ask but you. it's up to you. I can also just take this draw. Like that's. I think you're supposed to just take the draw. Yep, no problem. I completely forgot about the cockatrice interface. Damn, I think this actually might lose me the game. <laughs> but oh well, I live and learn. I'm going to play this silent clearing. Mm -hmm. I'll tap two, three, four, cast a run, okay. and say go. Uh, go to combat. Yep. For seven. I'll block one of those. I'll take six damage and six poison, right? Yep. Down to twelve, and then I'll just. 
indicate the poison by these? Um, I might as well cast a Sorcerer Spyglass. Okay, yeah, in response, um, activated abilities. Yeah, I'm just gonna actually it only stops activated abilities, right? Not. Yeah, so I could technically name one of your Horizon Lands and you can't sack it to draw a card, but you can still uh, yeah. do the mana ability. Yeah, I'll <laughs> tap one. I'm just going to do this already. I'm going to cast a Worldly Tutor. Okay. For... Well, I wish I could get Collector Oof, but I'm just going to die to Poison if I do that. If I double, if I block, if I get a creature, I still take four poison and die. Oh, I'm gonna get a Melira. The cure. Oh, yeah. I was like, what? You have a card that. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, she, she's here somewhere. Is it alphabetical order? Um. Yep, Melira the Living Cure. There he is. Yep. And put her on top. And then Spyglass they go. Resolves. Uh, I only have a source of pop shares in hand. Okay, I will name. Yep, makes sense. Go ahead. <laughs> yep. Draw here. You need to tap two for Melira. Yep. I'm going to tap. Uh, One like this, sack the silent clearing. Sure. Draw a card. Yep. Uh, attack you for four with Tron. Yep. There you go. Uh, I actually have something that stops poison that's very funny. It is pretty funny. Um, I guess I will attack with everything for six. Uh, that's one, two, three, four. I'll just take, um, I'll block one of the mites. Sure. Take five. Yeah. So you six. You gain one. Poison. And then I take one poison. Up to seven. Yeah. I'll play this defense grid. <laughs> well, I'm going to stack the canopy. Sure. To draw another card. Yeah. And that's it. I will say go. All right, uh, unzap, uh, draw here. Oh my god. Okay, yeah. Some Petal Grove. Yeah. I'll attack you for seven. Yeah, I got a one. All right. Bass. That's five damage on board. Yeah. You got it. It's good game oh too. my god! <laughs> Honestly, I'm gonna I'm gonna remember this forever. A game <laughs> where Melira's ability was actually useful. Yeah, that's true. I can't believe this. Take the play again. Um, or I guess I'll keep it. <laughs> I almost say I keep, but I just noticed that this hand has no la no lands, which is yeah. why it was so good. Yes. Okay, <laughs> I'll keep this. Okay. Uh, start with the Versus Saga. Yeah, I'll keep oh. this. Yep, go ahead. Versus Saga. Oh, I have oh. to bottom something. You have to bottom something, yeah. I'm gonna bottom... this card right here. All right, sorry, okay. go ahead. Play Voltaic Key. Uh-oh. Draw here. Uh, I'm going to play a Caracas. Mm -hmm. Cold Clamp. They go. Oh, goes to two. Oh. Am I getting? I'm always scared of Voltaic Key because it, that like has a fifty percent chance that I'm just gonna get time vaulted. Oh my god, that's a Academy <laughs> towards the Saga. Jesus. Um. Please, God, have mercy on my soul. 
I'll play the Sphere of Persistence. Let's take it out. Uh, <laughs> yep. Draw here. Going to play a Planes. And Pass. Alright, uh, this hand was a bit too risky, I think. Um, I guess I'll make a Construct. Yep. This will go away. We'll go get a animal. Yep. Jesus. One, two, three, five, so three, four, a talisman of conviction. Yep. And then I have two floating still, so I'll play this. Oh, guy, lantern, exiling my resistance. Yep. Card. Yep. There you go. Oh my god, I, I'm never punished. Oh, I guess I am kind of punished, but I'm going to Prismatic Fist for a forest here. Sure. I kept no green. I'm going to tap two, like mm -hmm. so. Collector, oof. And you need to tap three for that. Oh yeah, sorry. Alright, oh. now I only need to survive this... Uh, one, two, three, four, five. This six, six that's beating me over the head. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Pass. And you also tapping for one, two, three, four, five, six blue because of Academy. Don't worry, I've I've got this. Use one from Mana Vault because I can't untap it. Oh, well, I could. I guess I yep. could pay Mana for it. I guess I could pay. Yeah, mana you could. Uh, yeah, but I don't think that's a I, good idea I, considering Collector. Oof. Yeah, I already drew uh, a turn, so. Um, Alright, how do I handle the 6-6 six, six that's going to kill me in like 3 turns? Uh, what if it were a 7-7? Seven, seven? <laughs> Attack <or> Oh shit! I'll <laughs> <laughs> down to 12, no blocks! If this collector roof dies, I die! <laughs> right, <laughs> untap, keep draw here. Jesus. Okay. I'll tap 2 for yeah. a ignoble hierarch. I'll, just in case you have some kind of removal spell, actually, uh, if you have something that deals one damage, I'll just ad admit defeat. I'm gonna attach this cold clamp to the collector oof. Yeah. So it's now a 3-1. Yeah. Alright, say go! Okay, untap. I believe bolt taps, draw this one. Yep. Hmm. Got this spear of resistance. Yeah. <laughs> oh god, Jesus, please stop playing artifacts. Okay, there's an 8-8. Eight, eight. I am not dead yet. Not bad. Attack for 8. <laughs> I'll take 8 down to 4. Alright. Uh, untap. Keep draw here. Not what I wanted to see. Hmm. That, this, this, that. I'll just pass here, question mark? Untap, I'll keep leaving bolt tapped. Draw, lose one. Uh, funny. What is funny? It's not funny. Don't you dare. Guess I'll... No. Eight. Alright, I'll go to combat and attack for eight. Okay, I'm going to tap one. Two, three, I'm going to flash. Uh, I have to step four. I'm mm -hmm. going to flash in an endurance. Sure. Targeting, targeting you. Okay, I don't have any cards in my yard, so I'll, yeah. Yeah, I'll jump the construct. Sure. <laughs> I'm alive! I'll pepper eight, building a blue. A one. Play this cover to jewel. Yep. Me. 
I'll play this Tundra. And yep. Go. <clears throat> All right. Untap, upkeep, draw. I'll attack you for four with Collector Oof. I'll draw yep. three. Yep. Oh my god, please, for the love of god. I mean, no lands. Uh, Lush particle tapped. Sure. I leave this on top. I think I have to. Okay, leave that on top. Okay, I think I just have to try this now. Just actually, no, I don't. Uh, I'll pass turn. Tap, upkeep, leave all caps. Yep. I'm gonna tap for eight nine. Yep. Cast the Sundering Titan. Oh my Jesus! Uh, ATBs use a land of each, so you're going to destroy my forest and my plains. Is that correct? Uh, so this is resolving. I will choose. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. No, of course. Sorry, I have a I have a response. In like, I'm gonna I'm gonna cast something in response. I'm just like making sure. Uh, it's been a while since I've cast a, a Sinister Titan, so you can choose like something like Forest and Plains, and then both of mine die, but you also lose your Tundra. Is that correct? Yeah. Do you also lose your Razor Tide or no? No, because it doesn't have plant types. Oh, it's not. It's not the Scryland. Yep, that's fine. Okay. So ETP. Oh, yeah. I uh, I'll have it as well. I'm just gonna tap four. Sure. I'm going to flash in a opposition agents. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, you have black. Okay, yes. Okay, so ETP trigger, I will choose your forest for forest, your lush portico for plains, and my tundra for island. Yep. It's just a 9 -nine. I'm still standing. Da -da 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 -da. Back for none. I'll j jump with the opposition agents. Sure. I'm still standing. Okay, I'm going to flood a strand. Yeah. Cratchits. Yep. Sure. Start Vanna here. Yeah. Okay. Jesus Christ. Uh, God damn it. Uh, Um, I'm going to tap this planes sure. for a Mox Emerald. Actually, no, sorry. I, my collector oof shuts that off. Sorry. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, but Jesus. Fuck. Okay, I'm going to tap okay, so this, 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 this. Okay. Say go here. Untap, upkeep, the ball tap, draw. Um, I just need to write for 12 more turns. It's for 9. Use yep. 6 of it. Cast Rush of Knowledge. Fuck. Jesus. Fucking. Uh, okay, let me do some math here. Uh, I have 1, 2, 3... See if I tap tap like this. That's three, four. I got this fear of resistance is really fucking me. Um, yeah, just in case before you draw something, I think I just have no. I have I have to wait until blocks. Yep, go ahead. That resolves. Okay, I'll draw eight. Jesus. I am fighting for my life here. <laughs> Sundry Titan is only on, on ETB, right? Uh, or leaves. Just making... When it, ETBs or leaves. 
Okay, so I can so okay, so I can pretty much never kill that thing. Great, good to know. Oh, come on. We're gonna wasteland your savanna. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to do this now. I'm going to tap. I'm going to tap three. Mm -hmm. Like so. Cast an Eladromia Skull. Sure. I'll go get a Solitude. Okay. Into my hand. Yep. Say go. Okay. Um, I'll use three of this floating mana for a Marble Diamond. Yep. Go to combat. Yep. Uh, I think I'm just attacking. Oh, your Savannah's gone, by the way. No, it's not. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. Uh, I'm going to tap. I'm going to block both. Tap one. Ex uh, evoke solitude on the on the construct. Exdalia yeah. Talia. Uh, oh, sorry, I didn't say what blocks here. Uh, I actually think I ca I have to keep. Do I? I pretty sure I need the collector oof to die here, just that I can have enough mana with the Cauldron Jewel to do anything. Funny enough, or else I I think I just let me think. Actually, sorry. Oh, you're good. Uh, just for, uh, I'm I'm getting rid of the construct because, yeah, I'm not that that's something entirely leaving is just a death sentence for me. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm just thinking what blocks the titan here. If if it's oof, I get the mana from from the jewel. I can start casting stuff. If it's I also draw two. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah collector oof is going to eat dirt here. Okay. So, so you still have a high arc. Oof. I gain ten. Yeah. Collector well, oof dies. All yep. all artifacts are back. I'll draw two. Yep. Second main phase. Honestly, I I, I want props to myself by for surviving this long. Untap the mana vault. Yep. Three. Or five. Oh, or yeah. a short guy. Yep, that's fine. Pass. Go to clean up. I have to discard a bunch of things. We will discard. Yep. Solar block bridge. See you in the silo. <laughs> yep. Go ahead. All right. Untap. Up. Keep draw here. Okay, I am I am trying to survive here. Let me think here. Mm -hmm. uh, go to tap. Go to taps for three. Correct. Yes. Okay, I need a two blockers. No, I only need one. Unless you can have a creature that you can crew Shurikai in. Shurikai is what crew three or two? Crew eight. Eight. Okay, I'm yeah. I'm safe for now. Um. Am I safe? Three, four, five. Yeah, shit. Yes, I think I just. Uh. Hmm. What if I do that? One second. Okay. Um, tap this like that. Get this. This gets that. This. Oh, I, I can bounce you. I, I can bounce Shurikai, so I'm a little bit safer there. Okay, I'm going to tap four. Sure. For a recruit of the guard. Okay. I am going to go get. Oh shit! It costs one more. Fuck. Yeah. 
shit. Alright? Uh, shit, shit, shit. I still get that. Is it still worth it? Okay, I block the Sundering Titan with the Recruiter. I survive another turn, hopefully. If I get this, you already drew the cards. Got it. Jesus. Um, yeah, I f mm, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Mother of Runes, gas Mother of Runes, no, that doesn't do it. Okay. Okay, I think I have a plan here. I'm not sure if it's going to be good enough, but I'm going to go ahead and get a Bowmasters. Okay. Into my hand. Yep. And say go. Okay, untap, upkeep, I'll be alt tapped, draw, lose one. Uh, let's start by activating Shorkai. Yep. Draw, uh, draw. Okay, uh, that should do it. No, that, no, God, no. Um, tap this for lots of mana. Yep. Um, make a plateau, make a red. Make oh a second, no, red mana? Make a second red. Yep. Yep. That's some burning of Zinye. One, two, one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, that's GG's. Oh my god, I. You know what? I want to give props to myself. I fought the good fight there. Yeah, game three. All right, uh, I'm gonna be on the play. Yep. I'll keep. I'll keep this. I think. Uh. Sure. I'll try. That's. All right. Uh, main phase. Yavimaya. Mox Emerald, mm -hmm. Death Right Shaman, Hex Drinker. Okay. So go. Yep. Gonna play this Urza saga. Yep. Alright. Draw here. Uh Flood is strand. Yep. Um just thinking here. Mm -hmm. I'll crack it right now. Sure. I'll go get a Scrubland here. Mm -hmm. I'll then add a counter to Hex Drinker. Sure. Move to combat. I'll attack you for two. Okay, I got eighteen. Say go. Strong.
Alright, uh, hello? Can you hear me better now? Yes, I can hear you. Yeah, okay, uh, pretty much I was letting my headphones charge up a bit. Mm-hmm. Alright. Okay. Um, yep. Build volcanic island chrome rocks. Yep. I'm going to imprint this Ravages of War. Yep. And then we will. There you go. Um, end step, I'll tap the tree, exile yeah. the flood strength to attempt to cast a opposition agent. Yeah, yeah, that's what I expected. Yep. I'll oh, yeah. untap. Upkeep draw here. A uh, forest. Mm -hmm. Going to go ahead, put two counters on Hex Drinker. Yep. So it's now a 4 4. Yep. Move to combat. I'll attack you for 4 with Hex Drinker. Uh, yep, take four. And pass. And step, make a construct. Yep. Tap it. Draw. Uh, counter on Saga? Yeah, there's a counter on Saga. I'm thinking what I want to do. The constructs or float the mana? That is the question. <laughs> Sorry. Jesus Christ. Oh, I think I'm making a construct. Right. And then this goes away, and you get the see my life. Yep. Okay. Uh, sorry, this might take a while on, uh, for, because you have so many artifacts. Yep. Unless you, unless you want to tell me what to pick. <laughs> just kidding. Um, uh, yeah, I'm just waiting for you. <laughs> most of the zero and one CMC stuff is uh, arc it's mana, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm just like you have. There's an expedition map. That'll be halt. Yeah, I'm thinking here. Soul ring. Soul guy, my turn. Yeah, okay. yeah, also, I'm just taking a look at your deck in general. Yeah, yeah, no problem. Okay, so you don't. So, thankfully, you're not on time vault. No. I, I generally. Yeah, I generally had the. Idea just because senior cards didn't seem like time vault. Thankfully, I respect you. <laughs> uh, I think I already have enough mana here, so I think I, I want something. A uh, piffing needle could be an option. Naming chrome mox. Actually, piffing needle doesn't talk, doesn't stop mana. Never mind. Mm. Retrofitter foundry could be an option. Just start making that's, some. That's true. Yes. Yeah. yeah, I'm I'm just thinking between. Uh, if you, I'm just, I, I like talking up loud, so if no problem, no problem. Not like, I'm not, I'm not asking for your, like, your opinion or anything. Uh, yeah, I'm just thinking between Rider Fitter Foundry that gets me aboard and gets, um, that stops me from overcommitting just in case you have some kind of, uh, mass removal spell again. But to be fair, uh, you're not running balance, so I am, uh, oh, you are running balance, so I need to worry about that. 
So I'm thinking retrofitter foundry or something like uh, the expedition map, just so that I can get something like a survey land and start churning through my deck easier. But I don't think that's worth it. You know what? I'm just going to get the foundry, I think. I think it's the best target here. Okay. Not sure if it is, but I don't play enough artifact decks to find out. I'm going to keep this thing open. All right, retrofitter found me. Yeah. You still need to cast it, but yes. Um, oh, yeah, um, I still need to cast it for one. Oh, I'll, I'll cast it for one. Yeah. Well, I'll you'll cast it on, on, on your turn. Manner. You can't cast it on my turn. Oh, it's, oh, oh, it's not. Oops, sorry. My bad. Yep. Um, freeze. Um, uh, I guess I'll pass. Right. I'll untap, upkeep, draw here. Oh, that's a good draw. I'm going to play a strip mine. Mm-hmm. Do I actually want to my you? Like, because I'm pretty much the only... I mean, I likely do is this. I'm just thinking the only thing I lose to is balance. And, well, I can't really cut you off from white, so... Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna... Actually, first I'm gonna put... Uh, let me check how many counters this Hex Drinker needs again. It's level 8. So I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 exactly. But then I can't cast the Retrofitter Foundry, but I can cast that at any time, right? Doesn't need a position agent to be alive. Correct. Yeah, okay, so I'm gonna tap one, two, three, four, five, exiling the Saga. Yep. Put eight counters on yeah, the Hex Drinker. Yep. It's now a 6-6. Six, six. Protection from everything. Yep. Uh, I'll strip mine your... D depletion land. Yep. I'll attack you for six. Uh, yeah, I got an eight. There you go. Oh. Play this sky diamond. Play this solar yep. bluff bridge. Yep. Um. There you go. Right. Let's mm. keep draw here. Um, go to combat, swing at you for six. Yep, I got a two. Okay, now, do I play, now, are you running, actually, I, can, I, uh, I don't think you are, you were on any counter spells. So, let me think, did I see a force of will? I don't think I did. Did I see anything else that you could cast for free? I don't think so, so I'm gonna try... Something fun here. Okay. I'm going to pay two life. Sure. Actually, sorry. Uh, for, sorry. I'm going to tap a white to pass to exile your construct. I'll then pay two life. Uh, I'll tap. Oh, wait, shit. I don't have enough white mana. I was planning to kill you with death right. No, I know. I, I, I realized that. Um, yeah, sadly, shit. I don't have enough. Sadly, I don't have enough black mana. And I wouldn't search anyway from Bobby <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna so I'm gonna have to exile your construct. Sure, so this one this one's gone. Yep. Yep. And then I'm going to tap one, cast the retrofitter foundry. Sure. Can't some let me just there we go. And I'll say go here. Thank you, draw. What does that do? Does that do anything? Oh, I can't search for stupid off agent. <laughs> uh, Opposition yeah. agents do it. God's work. You got me. I forgot to hit cord on my game against Joho. He was on Red Deck Wins. Um, both games, I managed to assemble the One Ring plus Paradox Engine pretty early. Um, I think I 
turn three ring into turn four paradox engine for the first game. And the second game I had uh, an early paradox engine into Shorakai to buy me a bunch of time into the one ring to stabilize and uh, he conceded. I don't know if it was perfectly deterministic, but it was uh, pretty close. And if not, I could have Armageddoned away all his lands under a sphere of resistance and um, probably won the following turn. So it was reasonable for him to scoop. Sorry uh, for forgetting to hit record. Um, a lot of things going on. Sometimes I forget to hit the button. So no game three. Sorry about that. Well, once again, sorry for forgetting to record round three, uh, considering it was the only round I won today. Uh, it was a pretty quick match, though. It was like four turns each game. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, this deck is definitely uh, a heck of a pile, but uh, it's not like my matches were, you know, I got crushed today. Uh, in match one against um, La File or Flavia, if they had just rolled worse on Comet that one game, I probably would have won. Um, if I had drawn better that last match uh, after I had Armageddon all, away all the lands, I probably would have won. Actually, it was pretty funny. I think me not casting, I think I had Burning of Zinye, or maybe it was Wildfire, when they had one land, was actually a mistake. You know, I made a mistake with sequencing my lands. I probably should have played out more lands and wildfired them away so that they stayed on only one mana, so they never got to Brotherhood's End. Um, and then I probably would have won. So, you know, match one, even though it looked like I got kind of crushed, um, really was a lot closer than it looked. And match two, um, you know, that game one was kind of hilarious, and that I probably should have won, and then Malira's random text saves the day. Uh, so, it's kind of funny. Uh, definitely got a little bit messed up by the early Cathar Commando. Again, it, it's not like I didn't expect it, you know. Uh, people are teching against artifacts right now because of Time Vault. But, you know, if the person, if um, Holy Bay didn't have the Cathar Commando, I had a very easy early Tinker, which would have just completely obliterated him. So that was fine. And then obviously that last match I got obliterated by, um, I got completely screwed over by Opposition Agent. But that also happens, you know. My line was perfectly fine going for an early Urza Saga if they didn't have exactly Opposition Agent. And they had exactly Opposition Agent, so that's magic. Um, yeah, uh, it's surprising how effective <laughs> this deck is, considering how ridiculous it looks. Um, a lot of fun. Uh, definitely something that I enjoy playing. I don't know if I'll keep playing it, but I don't know. It's pretty fun. I might pick it up once in a while. But uh, yeah, that was Just Guy Wildfires. Uh, honestly, even though I went 1-2, I had a lot of fun. It's pretty good showing. Um, and I enjoyed all the matches. So that was Just Guy Wildfires. Thank you for watching the Jet Sky Wildfires gameplay. For more gameplay videos, check out the playlist on the left. For some long form theory content, check out the playlist on the right. Feel free to leave a comment down below and uh, like and subscribe. Thank you again for watching the video. Have a great day. See you next time.